right welcome to the channel this is tesla dmv all right so we are out here in washington dc um it, it was raining it just stopped raining so got some uh, debris and stuff down here and fsd is in control so this is 10.69.3.1 this is, we're still in the first 100 miles of uh, this car receiving uh, FSD beta. So I'm actually testing in it out. In 500 feet, turn left onto Beach Drive Northwest. Making sure there's no bugs. All right, so buckle up guys. We got a pretty cool drive here ahead. Um, we're in Washington, D.C. getting ready to now head on. Now turn left onto Beach Drive Northwest. Getting ready to head on to Rock Creek Parkway. And it's a really scenic drive over here, so I thought I would record it and let FSD do the driving. FSD meaning full self-driving, which is like um, Tesla's self-driving software, which um, when I'm recording this in uh, December 2022, this cost uh, $15,000 in addition to your car. So I'll make another video on what are the differences of having autopilot, enhanced autopilot and full self-driving. So this is FSD, full self-driving. Did a great job about slowing down on that speed hump. So here we go. So we're on, um, what is this exactly? Just so I'm correct. This is Beach Drive still. We're, we're not on Rock Creek Parkway. In order for us to get on Rock Creek Parkway, we got a pretty uh, nifty maneuver. We got to go through a traffic light and we got to go through a stop sign. So here we go. Let's see how we do. Um, keep in mind, FSD is not perfect uh, with poor weather or uh, maybe construction or variables that, you know, weren't meant to be like a tree in the road. Um, just after a big storm like it it may not work around these particular you know incidents so for all the new testers out there um, please be careful always pay attention uh, have your eyes on the road you know um, appreciate the levels of um, work that went behind the software so that my car doesn't just go straight down into this ditch that's probably like 40 feet down um, and there's like no edge over here, you know, so FST is, is doing its thing. Speed limit 25, it automatically knows. Um, does a little bit of phantom braking there. I nudged it there, so... Could be because it was just raining and maybe the cameras are wet still. Um, but if that's the case, it's still operating phenomenally for wet cameras, um, which think they recommend you know you go and dry them off every so often if it is like that but this is a, a beautiful drive out here it's a really nice um, if the weather's nice to even do like a hike and stuff out Rock Creek Parkway um, in 500 like... feet bear right to stay on Beach Drive Northwest all right so here we go stop sign ahead I don't know is this the this is the you know there's a couple stops on the head so this is just one um, and FSD does a good job about, you know, recognizing when it's your turn. Like right now it knows it's my turn, so it knows that I got there before that car. All now right. they're right to stay on Beach Drive Northwest. Here we go. This is a tricky scenario here. Gonna kind of follow it. It slowed down, but it was able to handle it. But now watch this. This is where things get really tricky. It's narrow. Um, we do have a little barrier, but there's like a small canal here to my right. Um, but again, the car is steering. You know, when I first got FSD beta or even auto steer, watching the steering wheel move was like, the, like it was like a movie, you know? 